What's up guys, check it out. In this box is the latest Skep RC Taker F745BT 8-bit powerful 60 amp stack developed by the team at Gap RC. Let's open it up and check it out. Paper instructions, awesome, and it's color too. We have the ESC diagram, a social media card if you want to tag them, a support card, and ooh, look at this. Purpose built, love the black and gold finish. In the box, we have a black XT60. It's got a nice fat 14 AWG wire, a bunch of hardware, a capacitor. Looks like the capacitor is rated for 47035V. Comes with four M3 by 24 screws and four M3 by 30 screws to secure your stack. There's also eight clear nuts and four extra gummies. And then we have a boatload of plugs because this board features lots of plug and play ports. Seems like this is the trend these days, but if you like soldering, you can still solder all your connections at the bottom of the board. I'm really liking this because now it makes quads much easier to work on. It totally makes sense because if you take apart your car, it's all plugs too. So the Taker F745 features a high performance STM32 F745 VGH6 chip with a Cortex M7 core that can run up to 216 megahertz. This is perfect for racing, freestyle, FPV drones for super fluid movements. With that, you can run higher PID loops, DSHOT 600 with RPM filtering and use less CPU load. We have a dual gyroscope setup using both MPU 6000 and ICM 42688P. We also have a Bluetooth chip so you can change your settings on the Betaflight app on your phone and huge memory storage for your black box where you can activate it by simply pushing this button. We also have the potential to have eight motor outputs making it compatible with X8 drones. Seven UART ports are featured but there's only one that's taken by Bluetooth. So it can handle all the peripherals you can throw at it. It also has a barometer so you can check your altitude. We also have a type C USB port and a independent BEC with 12V at 2.5A and 5V at 3A outputs. As for power filtering, we have an integrated LC filter will give you a less noisy, smoother ride. So both the FC and ESC have mounting holes of 30.5 by 30.5 millimeters and the ESC can take a continuous current at 60 amps. It can also do a burst of 5 seconds at 65 amps. And the supported protocols are D-Shot 150 all the way to 600 and can take 3 to 6S lipos. The weight for the FC is 8.8 .8 grams and the ESC is 15.4 grams and for both it's 24.3 grams. And look at that great price for only $79.99. So finally, who is this stack for? Well, any quads that's five inch and up where you fly like a racer or freestyle where you do full throttle bursts often, having a powerful stack like this can take any abuse with ease. 60 amps gives you additional headroom to ensure durable electronics protection and reliability. Not just full sending, but hard crashes where power surges could happen suddenly, frying all your other electronics in the process. But if you race or full throttle often with 7 inch drones and up, like 8 inch, 9 inch, 10 inch, 11 inch, 12 inch, I think a stack like this is absolutely mandatory because full throttle pulls with heavy drones, you're going way above 100 amps for all four motors. I'll install this stack in a future build and I'll let everyone know how it's holding up. And that's it guys, hope you enjoyed the first look video of the Gap RC Takers F745 60 amp stack. If you did, please thumbs up, subscribe and leave a comment. If you're interested in purchasing a stack, go ahead and check out the links in the description below. If you purchase from those links, I get a small commission which supports the channel. Thanks again for watching and see you on the next one.